isn't terrible. Okay. When it's nighttime, it's kind of like it's all dark and everything kind of looks like shiny away. It's forever raining here, which ironically is kind of what we've got here most of the time at the moment. I was going to say, I'm like, it never normally rains here until it's like late December. Uh, where have I got to go? I gotta go all the way down there. What is that? Oh yeah, that's right. That's someplace. Um, I'm not that far from there. I do want to uh, get away from that. It's mine. Yeah, I want to kind of stop off in town, I think. And see if I can like just sell and repair some stuff. Oh shit, not that. That's not what I wanted. I, I moved my hand. I moved my hand and now everything's gonna die. Jesus Christ. How's your morning going, Bubba? How was, uh, how was yesterday? Jeez. Actually, you know what I should start doing is I should ask you, like, how you slept. Maybe you got a good night's sleep or something. Oh. Come on! These guys are, like, so hard to kill. They don't do a lot of damage. They're just really hard to kill. Uh, I, I gotta admit, I kind of want to fight things that aren't necessarily these like lichen things everywhere. I don't know if it's just because of the area that I'm in. And everything's kind of like a werewolf. Um, but I kind of want, I don't know, I didn't mind getting like the, uh, what do you call it, the, uh, yeah, the shamany things. My brain's just completely just stopped. The carvers and shit, you know? That kind of crap. Uh, there's stuff in town I should probably do. Like, are you... You're an armor guy. You're a blacksmith. Uh, let's not get rid of everything just yet. Got some armor and shit I can use. Hold up. What? Not the right one. Yeah, all right. Night artifact. Oh, yeah, that had a stone in it. That's fine. Chaos grips. Jesus Christ, I've probably got triantha grips now. I have raccoon hands. They'll help. They'll help for like pilfering stuff from my enemies. Resistant all enemies uh, elements, sorry. Shock shock skill damage? Oh probably lightning. Shrine buff duration. Control impaired duration. Not really. Like resistance elements, that generally gets me to get it. I could probably change that one. That does. I do have a thing on it for armor. That one does lucky hit damage, damage distant enemies, fire damage. That one's. Oh, uh, they both do fire damage though. Does one do fire damage? Wait, I'm. <laughs> of course, it's a fucking amulet. I'm not even looking at the right thing. Does this one do the healing bubble? Yes. I kind of don't want to change over the healing bubble thing if I don't have to. Alright, that should be fine. More than horseshoes and nails. What do you need? I need stuff, sir. So I also require the repairs. I'm starting to like die occasionally, so I actually require money for that. Alright, what have I got? What have I got skill wise? The inner flames, primacy skill steals 3% increased damage while you're healthy. That ain't. I got that originally with the idea that I'm like, oh yeah, when I enter a battle, I'm so healthy and I'll be able to pull off all these attacks and it will do so much damage. And I, I don't even get close and somebody smacks me upside the ear and I'm just like, cool. Now I'm not in health. Let's see, firewall. Firewall isn't too bad. I do use that a lot. I do like my little Hydra. I do want Hydra to be stronger because it's basically like, it's like a turret, basically. This one is, I guess it's buffed. Yeah. Fireball is strong now that it's up in levels. Fireball isn't too bad. These are all four. Oh, no, not using. I guess I could level up Hydra, then bring it down to Firewall. It's like Hydra is pretty good. I didn't actually check what it modified then, but I guess it's going to be dealing 97 damage over 10 seconds. And then I could get an additional head on it. Oh, while you're healthy, your cast of Hydra gained one additional head. Okay, so that's why sometimes I have the four head and sometimes I got three and sometimes I got to recast to get the fourth. 
Interesting. I did not know that. Hey, so thank you. Scosglen, and you'll be stronger for it. I have heard his wolf's lament. The fane is now one with nature. Perhaps that is for the best. The fane, my kin. What happened to you? Mm hmm. Okay, so she was able to hear the wolf howl from back here. Now, jeez, what the fuck is? Why is that on a partial health? Okay, must be like a boss thing. So I've got to get down to here, essentially, right? If I wanted to, I could town pool and I'd be right there. I kind of almost feel like that because this looks like... This looks like I don't have to go into it unless I've got these quests. So I might actually just do that because I was going to traverse through here and I'm like, I'll unlock all this and I'm like, I'll do that later. <laughs> I probably won't do it later. That's a, that's a fair call. See, this looks awesome, but this just reminds me of like fucking, I don't know, the Lord of the Rings shit. Uh, speaking of, I probably should like organize another fucking movie night at some point. Let's see, where are we going? The both ways are just as long as each other. Don't click the thing. Oh man, yeah, I just had a thought, and I'm like, what I should do is organize like a movie night or something like that for fucking I, I thought about it I'm like for like Valentine's Day or something like that because like Valentine's Day is one of those days it's like not super big deal to me kind of thing and I'm, like there'd be probably a few people that aren't potentially are not celebrating and stuff but I'm like at the same time I wouldn't want to have like a continuation and like force people to like miss it or change their plans or something like that I was just like it's just a uh, just one of those other day, other event things. But yeah, I don't know. I'll do another one eventually. I want to do another one again. Uh, oh, hello. It's able to collect some runic tablets. Oh, thank you. There are many lessons, prayers, and seeds of wisdom that have been passed down from Fiacla Gair himself contained within. Life is an endless lesson. There is so much left to learn. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah? Finish the side quest thing. Hold on. Here are my herbs out. I love how the first thing she does is just throw them on the ground. Also, it looks like when you sell an item and it's got a gem in it, it automatically just puts it Oh, sorry, I'm yawning. It automatically just puts it in your inventory. Ah, uh, the downside's to lack of sleep. Oi! I thought you were a guard. I was like, oh man, that's a... That's a burly looking guard up here. I'm like, he's all decked out in spikes, and then he fucking threw a fucking spike at me, and I'm like, that is not a guard. That's the kind of guard for the place. Mate. Oh uh, yeah, I see you doing things. That you back off from me, you can't. Ah, uh, yeah. Have yourselves a little hydra, and be over here in the fire. I need time. Jesus Christ, I don't know if these guys are scaling up. I'm guessing they are, but Jesus Christ, they're difficult. Ah. Uh. I had to I had to scratch my head as that was happening. I'm like, I'm gonna get hit. For sure. I can get a second hydrant there. Oh there's a fucking decent ring in here. Oh that straight up nearly killed me. That almost killed me. What did I get? A swanky looking ring. Kind of looks like a swollen finger though. Resistance to all elements, cold resistance, lightning damage, damage over time, damage to sun enemies, barrier generation, healing meteors, fall during inferno, dealing 
Two of one fire damage on impact. Your meteorites mobilize enemies. Your second sorceress only. Interesting. That's not a bad ring. Like, I don't do lightning damage unless it's going to cast lightning damage. I'm guessing it, it's like with the fire damage, it just buffs whatever your skills are. And the damage is done stuff. Barrier generation. If barrier generation... Oh, no, it might be like shield. I'd be like the shield fire thing that I've got. I'd, I have the ability to like research, but I haven't done it. Hi, can I get a couple of you guys together? Yeah, I'm not ready yet. There we go, group photo. <laughs> that was just like the one guy that kept backing back and I'm like, he's going to back out of here, except that he doesn't know that I'm going to straight up just pull him into this fight. Whether he wants to or not. I am on precious mana. Oh. Thanks for dropping the gold up. No, I don't need to go up. I just saw a thing and I'm like, I'll definitely climb that. All right. Where is it? Over. I'll have to find another way inside. Okay. There must be a cellar. This. I must admit, Diablo is a world that has a lot of cellars and all sorts of stuff, but then again, I understand like food storage and things were like a little bit different in this style of era, you know? Uh, where? I didn't think I was getting called from this side. Is it up here? Oh, yeah. Um, could you have not just let me in? Where is Donan? The horned woman. The beast. Nothing could stop them. Not our steel. Not our prayers. <sighs> Listen to me. I must find Donan. Where is he? Some... Somewhere inside. Dead. Like the rest, for all I know. The light has forsaken this place. What was a light groaning noise then? Okay, off we go. I can only imagine being like my character and just like endlessly fighting things. Like apart from like occasionally taking like a hit from like these cursed like demons and stuff like that, I imagine it must be fucking grueling. Like very constant and unwavering. Regardless of like whatever she's feeling like, she's still gotta fucking persist on and deal with this shit. Yeah. And yes, I understand that this is not normal logic for like fucking playing a game to think about this stuff, but too bad. <sighs> deal with it. There's a lot of pictures of this guy everywhere. He's like fucking ancient religious, uh, what do you call it? Celebrity. Oh. Well, that was a bit gross. A little bit gross graphic. I don't think that there's a um, shaman one. Oh, hello. Big dude. I'm gonna stand back here. No. That actually went really well. I kind of like did a bait and switch there for a second. It was gonna hit me and I managed to just absolutely slide out of there. Pretty good. I can hear something further in. <laughs> I'm sorry, I shouldn't get that much enjoyment out of like just destroying like people's like homes and shit, but I do. Like obviously it's under you know, new tenants. But still. Oh, I got knocked down. Back off mate. Big dude's able to stun me if he hits me. Come on, you're that close to dying. Playing Marauder. I am trying to like see what they are when they're running up because some of them are harder than the others. And sometimes if you know that one like brings another, it helps. Uh I like these like little outside terrace areas as well, they're like built in everywhere. Okay. 
So that will take me back upstairs. I don't want to go upstairs. Hi. Oh, Jesus. Let's get you a couple of firewalls while you're stuck there. Out of mana. Look, I am out of mana. That's not really that big of a concern. So I should be able to regenerate it pretty well now. At least better than I have been. I just destroy everything. I would love to have, there used to be like this like fan of knives type one you can kind of like do with the, oh, what was it? The demon hunter. Be able to do a fan of knives with demon hunter and destroy everything in like your direct vicinity. It's great. I think I killed him then. Or he's just thrown up. <laughs> that was a little excessive, but it's fine. I figured out that I can put them in the binding thing, put a hydra underneath them, then put a couple of firewalls underneath them and roast them while they can't move. That seems to work really well. But yeah, I have to kind of like get the right kind of pattern for it. I am. It's like Starcraft. Build more fucking pylons. Put more fucking pylon so I will yell at you. I gotta admit, fucking playing StarCraft is one of those ones where like they very aggressively do not like how fast I will not build, build things. It's like, you need this. It's like, what do you think I'm fucking trying to do? That was not what I was trying to destroy, but sure. I'm heavy boots, do a thing. I thought maybe I could destroy the door then. Uh, that is on fire. Sure. I think I could have come up this way before. There's no point not opening it. What was that? What did you do behind that door, sir? Get you a couple of firewalls up there. Oh, wow. Okay, so after the third spin, they're able to approach. Gotcha. Getting better at it. Getting better. I think Diablo would be one of those games where if I played it a couple of days in a row, or like a week at a time, I would probably be substantially better at it. But because I'm only like playing it once a week and I've got to kind of remember, oh shit, I gotta remember what the fuck I was doing with everything. Can I get out of here please? Jesus Christ. Oh man. Oh, I'm dead. I'm so dead. Yeah, I was not gonna fucking get through that. All right, my durability. This is what I was talking about earlier. So when I said that I was like breaking everything and turning every fucking rock to pick up every goddamn coin I could get, there was a reason for it. I know that like as the game progresses, I will die really like consistently. Um. And I know it's got a lot to do with like how I fight and what I use and blah blah blah, so on and so forth, whatever. But um, yeah, I just find that sometimes, sometimes it's like really frustrating to like repair all my shit and or used to be like you'd lose like a percentage of gold on death instead of like, well you'd lose durability and a bit of your money and then you'd have to go back to town and you'd have to repair your shit. Like, it was definitely a lot. I gotta admit, at least when you die now, I think you lose... You lose durability, I don't think you lose money. I don't mind not losing money on death because I still have to pay money to repair my shit. Back up, mate. Come back. Right, just stand there. Yeah. I don't know, it isn't too bad. Some of the differences that they've got is nice. I definitely have like expressed like some of the things that I do enjoy, at least. Alright. Hi. <laughs> oh. Come on. Yeah, I always find that there's always like one straggler 
It kind of takes for ages to kill orgy. I'm not ready yet. Yeah, I'm not ready for this. This is oh shit kind of territory. Holy fuck nuts. Oh, I'm so gonna die in here. Yeah, for sure. Unless I can actually get out. Oh, man. Let me out of that. No, I got feared. I love how they just like, they just fuck off. They're like, right back to where we were supposed to be. And I'm like, get your ass back here. Let me kill you properly. Alright, I've got all my fucking spells back. Alright, I'm coming for you guys. Jesus, that was bad. I wasn't expecting there to be like this clusterfuck of fucking monsters here. Come to me. Come here. Have yourself some Hydra and some fucking other things. I won't stand it there. You can have all the things. I can just get out of this. I don't want to run further up. I want to actually get past you. Oh no! <laughs> oh, I'm feared. Fuck it. I, I don't... Can't health when feared. I'm not ready yet. No, I'm not. But, I'll tell you what, if you got to come past my fire... Oh, Jesus. Yeah, I do. Let me get that. You guys can follow me back here. There was like health globes and shit. That's right. Follow me. Can I have a Hydra? Where is my Hydra at? There we go. Jesus Christ, mate. You are difficult to kill. And you! You, you fucking poisonous bastard. Let's get out of your poison. Alright. That was a lot. It was actually very hard to deal with. I've got to like, I don't know, I've got to approach shit slower and like not just immediately run straight past it into the next group. That is a lot of what my problem is. I'm not going to stop doing it, but at least I know what I'm doing wrong. There's a difference to being oblivious to something versus like doing something with full awareness. Uh, well, this looks like where I'm supposed to be. So, there's a lot of like torturing corpses and shit going on. Hold up. I saw a table that needed to be destroyed. I have nice things. Imagine if I could. I didn't know I could get rid of this seat. I've missed so many seats. There is no achievement for destroying stuff, by the way. I just like doing it. Uh. happened I'm I guess up on the wall now oh yeah this is where I was talking to the guy light cleanse these faithful servants of their sin bring them peace in death okay Bloody miracle you made it here in one piece. Lilith and that beast tore right through us. Could have killed me too. But she left me untouched. She's toying with me. She wants me to... Watch her destroy everything I've built. Damn it! <laughs> Did you see Yorin the way you came? No. <sighs> she hasn't won yet. There's still a chance to stop her. <sighs> but I can't do it alone. <sighs> I'm with you. Where is she now? An old chamber beneath the keep. That's where Astaroth is. I didn't vanquish him like the stories say. I imprisoned him in a soul stone. It was a last resort. I built Eldheim over the stone to contain its evil. I've spent my life Watching over it, keeping it a secret, 
So Astaroth would never hurt anyone again. Not even my son knows. I'm sorry for hiding this from you before. But I couldn't risk a stranger finding out the truth. We should get moving. Follow me. If you didn't see Yorin outside, we'll search on the way. Huh. So, if soul stones and stuff like that from previous Diablos and stuff are supposed to contain evils and whatnot. When was the last time you saw Yorin? We were discussing what happened to Erida, and then Lilith stormed the keep. I ordered some guards to escort him out of Eldheim. I should have stayed with him. The other thing too is from the past, whenever you used a soul stone, regardless of the evil that you like trapped inside of it, it would tend to seep out and poison the land and the waters and the creatures and stuff in the vicinity. So building a building, or building a fucking city over the top of a soul stone of a trapped evil is not a smart thing to do for starters. It's actually really fucking dangerous. It's it's so fucking dangerous. But he's done that. So I wonder how well it was contained. Or if like if it was like a problem magnet all the time. Like where he was, if there was issues. Mind you, it's interesting to hear soul stones being used. It's nice. I was wondering if there was going to be any soul stone action. I still remember when you could like collect Diablo stone and use it as like a gem and shit. That was some weird stuff. I was like, hi, you now have Diablo soul stone after you've killed him. Um, you can now put this was with Yorin. You can now put this in armor or helm or whatever. I think you're supposed to put it in a helm, which was really weird because Diablo himself used to have it embedded in his skull. So last of my son's guardians. Come quickly. Yorin's mace is here. I told them to get out. Maybe he and the knights tried to stop Lilith. Could she have taken him somewhere? What possible reason would she have? He means nothing to her. We need to move. The way to Astaroth is through here. Yeah, right. I kind of figured that, mate. Little steppies? Steppies. Oh, slidey steppies. Even better. Yeah, that doesn't sound ominous at all. What the fuck? I just saw the fire feet and I'm like... Nope. Asking myself that same question, but I'm as much in the dark about it as you are, I'm afraid. They share a connection, though, and a strong one at that. Astaroth is a guardian of Lilith, Mephisto, the Lord of oh. Hatred. Ah, huh. that's who she's fucking born to. I was gonna say, I'm like, she does have like. I don't really like seeing the family resemblance so like right now specifically, but like it does make a lot of sense. She's a little bit like Mephisto. Like I guess like physically. How did you Mephisto looked like he was kind of like had a life and then died and then like whatever remained of him became like an evil. What is buffing these guys? I don't know if my guy's doing stuff or if he's I think he's doing stuff. I need time. Don't worry, I'll cast shit eventually. Like, these guys with their little, like, fire hands. It's interesting. Oh, I get it. They're just invisible. They're not actually coming out of anywhere. They've been here the whole time. Okay, so this guy's ability seems to be he can trap them. <laughs> he can... He can hit them. I think he can slow them down. I think that's what he's been doing. Even that of the purple glow on them means something else. I haven't seen it yet. That'd be interesting. Hidden tomb. Alright. Uh, I'm a 
following you now. All right. Either way, mate, I am catching up. I could be faster. It could just be my pathing. This is really interesting. Here it is. The soul stone chamber. Lilith has what she wanted all this time. She took the stone. No sign of Yorin, though. 